Oke okay guys, come back with me Jeremy di channel Sainix Metro Data Technical <coughs> Di channel Sainix Metro Data Indonesia juga Jadi kali ini aku akan kasih tips dan trik untuk membuat uh, template profile BGP dari yang kalian inginkan Jadi memang mungkin video ini akan terlihat cukup panjang Jadi mungkin teman-teman bisa sabar Oke, okay. ya yeah. in this tutorial I will show you how to create template BGP Ya, yeah. If you have a connection for using BGP Force point can support too, oke? Okay? Oke, okay. sekali lagi untuk teman-teman yang sudah subscribe channel ini, terima kasih. Uh, untuk yang belum, ayo channel channel kita di subscribe supaya kalian juga bisa dapat update update terbaru dari kami, ya. Bagaimana cara penggunaan teknologi teknologi terbaru dalam dunia IT? And baik yang mau komen, bagi yang mau uh, bertanya, diskusi. Ataupun kritik silahkan di, di komentar di komen di bawah ya komentar di bawah oke okay. uh, oke okay. langsung aja nggak usah banyak apa kita berlama-lama lagi waktu kita terbatas oke okay. langsung aja login to your SMC ya login ke SMC go to configuration ya yeah. and then I will show go to the SD WAN in here and other element oops Sorry, uh, sorry, NGFW, and, okay, other element, and dynamic routing element, yeah. So go to the configuration, other element, dynamic routing element, yeah. You see in here, just uh, expand this. You can see same in here. Jadi sama, mau buka di sini, di sini sama. Go to BGP element. <coughs> Ada lima hal yang nanti dibutuhkan. Pertama, apakah kalian mau PG profilnya yang mana? Ya, lalu AS numbernya atau nomor sistemnya, And then BGP connection profile, and then BGP peering, and then external BGP peer. Jadi di sini akan kita bermain untuk apalagi biasanya menggunakan external BGP peer biasa dari provider. Oke, langsung ada aja ini BGP profile. Presetnya sudah ada, kalian mau pakai ini itu sudah available ya tapi kalau kalian mau custom sendiri bisa just new BGP profile let's say demo BGP oke okay. port 179 179 ya yeah. just only oke okay. simple and go to the BGP connection profile ya yeah. if you want go to uh, BGP connection just create it ya yeah. using TCP MD5 and then the others If you do not want, just leave it. Okay. So go to autonomous. Nah, in this uh, page, yeah, in this page you must insert all the autonomous system number that you have. Let's say you have site one have a thousand, site two one. So <coughs> let's say site one, yeah. And then the so autonomous system or AS number is 35,000. And you can create it. Site 2, 35,001. 35,001. Okay. Okay. Go to BGP peering. Create BGP peering. Just give the name that you want. Let's say site 1 BGP appear okay go to advance and at local as as ebgp only prepend enter the 35 30 35000 i mean just okay and create for site 2 <coughs> site 2 bgp peer okay Prepend 35001. Okay, and go to external BGP peer, and this external BGP peer create the oh sorry create the eBGP peer site one. I predict let's say 172 uh, 1 170 120 I mean 
the autonomous number let's fill the blank first okay cannot so this is the 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 other side of your provider as number so you must provide it I'm sorry I forgot just create new let's say provider ASBGP let's say this is 50,000 okay just enter it okay and you have a two side create another EBGP peer side 2 let's say IP address 172 uh, for the 15.30 let's say the other number number still same provider ASBGP and it's done and the other things if you have create uh, NGFW first time you must create the BGP okay in here for the routing dynamic routing you can enable it and then you select your demo bgp and autonomous number is uh, itself site one okay <clears throat> so for the first time let's say site one i i repeat my my config to uh zero touch provide provider okay zero touch deployment yeah so interface i create let's say <coughs> the interface tree as a bgp let's say i create new bgp okay this link is using bgp link bgp network okay uh, let's say i give the 172 Okay, wait a minute. Uh, I back to my dynamic routing element, BGP element. Side to BGP. Okay, I use. Oops, sorry. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, external BGP peer. Let's say this is uh, the IP. Okay, I give the IP into, uh, let's say I choose this using uh, 240, okay, sorry, 248, okay, I think I'm not, uh, still have any okay I change into 17 first and I change into this into 118 This is because uh, the 119 has uh, in broadcast IP address cannot use so I use OK so I go to the routing in here and I use add in here go to the BGP peering site 1 BGP peer <coughs> okay it's done and add external BGP peer that you all already created dynamic routing already on and save it okay there is a no route to management server I think this it's uh, let's create it another just just it's just for uh, hidden the error okay let's say I create uh, I entry physical that interface 0 external using uh, internet link 
because uh, there is no too many root to management server and give the dynamic IP address just like that. Just to prevent the error first, just a minute. Okay, continue. Okay, uh, it's, I create uh, just another row to management server. Yeah, <coughs> let's say into this, uh, change into Azure's SMC, and let's say in route. Yeah, any network, you know, just save it again, saving site one. Let's see if there is issues. Okay, it's ready. Okay, so it's uh this is a tutorial, a simple tutorial for you to create a com uh, config for B external BGP peer. So you can try it at your uh, environment at your demo so we hope if you have any question any troubleshoot or any uh, discuss want to a discussion question just comment the field below now it's uh it's done for me now ya yeah, selesai jadi itu bagaimana caranya membuat config for external bgp route ya yeah, untuk teman-teman yang mau menggunakan nanti bisa di lapangan ada customer yang menggunakan bgp route So you can config with this tutorial. Oke, okay? segitu aja dari saya untuk saat ini dan sekali lagi <coughs> saya masih ingatkan untuk yang komen, diskusi, untuk yang mau bertanya, ya saran dan kritik juga kami terima. Silakan komen di bawah. Yang mau subscribe masih kita tunggu sampai terus terusan kita ingetin bahwa channel ini akan update kalian teknologi teknologi terbaru. Oke, okay? itu aja dari uh, saya sekarang ini. Dan ciao.